Hello there. Welcome to this video guide dedicated to the newest Power DVD 18 from Cyberlink. Please leave us comments and suggestions below this video to help us improve our next video guides for Power DVD. Cyberlink Power DVD is a great movie and media player with a simple user interface, providing great enhancements on either offline media or streaming videos. It is an awesome choice for home theaters, entertainment systems, PC, laptops, and also the latest VR headsets for both 3D and 360 videos. In this video, we will present the Ultra version of this software. Consider that some of the features shown may not be available if you use a different version. Power DVD opens with a welcome screen, showing two possible options. PC mode and TV mode. PC mode is the main interface optimized for computers and laptops, whereas TV mode is an easier and simplified interface suitable for TVs and remote controls. To see all the features inside Power DVD, we will use the PC mode. The main interface is divided into several parts. On the left, you have the Browse panel. On the right, the main preview, and at the bottom, its player. Under Media Library, you can quickly find online or offline media, which can be movies, videos, pictures, and music. Let's check it out. The Movies TV section is dedicated to all the movies and TV shows. On the first page, called Movie Info, you can get news about the newest films in theaters, the latest DVDs and Blu-rays coming out, and also find new movies or TV shows through several most popular, watched, or rated playlists made from the Cyberlink community, complete with trailers, cast, plots, and suggestions inside. At the bottom, you can also get additional information on top celebrities with biography and filmography. Use Movie Disc to start watching your DVD with all the visual enhancements of Power DVD. Under Movie Library and TV Shows, you can start watching offline movies or shows stored on your computer. In particular, TV shows are organized in seasons automatically. At first, both the Movie Library and the TV show sections are empty, since no folders are linked to Power DVD. To import media from your own folders or hard drives, use the plus button next to the Media Library, and then the Add Folder button to browse and link your own folders for each section inside Power DVD, such as movies, TV shows, and also videos, photos, and music. When you go to OK, Power DVD recovers and collects all the media from these folders, making them accessible directly from its interface and updated anytime. To unlink any connected folder, just use the Bin button next to it. Inside Movie Library and TV Shows, all the media files are shown with thumbnails and a colored marker next to each title. This is filled in yellow, in case the file has never been watched, halved in case it has been watched partially, and completely transparent in case you have watched it fully. Double-click on Media Files or Seasons to open and watch these. Videos and photo sections are used to collect all your offline and personal media. In a single or multiple folders, you can browse or shuffle through the top arrows. The music section collects all your songs from your linked folders, organized in artist, albums, or listed together under All Songs, complete with title, length, and all main metadata. To look for your media rapidly, you can use the search bar in the top right corner, or use the My Computer section on the left, where you can browse all your computer folders and hard drives directly. Inside Power DVD, you can also collect media by making custom playlists. By default, you have one called Recently Played, but you can create your own by using New Playlist. 
just set up a name for it, and drag and drop media files on it, either from PowerDVD or from any computer folder. In addition, you can connect your CyberLink cloud account to PowerDVD to store up to 30 gigabytes of media files on the cloud for one year. Now, let's see all the amazing features inside PowerDVD which are dedicated to media entertainment. When opening any video file, this covers the whole PowerDVD interface, with the main player buttons at the bottom used to play back, pause, or stop or regulate any volume or zoom level. Use Crop to Fill to extend the video to the PowerDVD window size, and use Full Screen to play back in Full Screen mode. You can also select the part of the media you want to watch by moving the lateral markers on the timeline bar. PowerDVD also has advanced features to improve media entertainment. Its True Theater feature, Inside Video Enhancements, improves the output quality even better than the original by applying corrections on color, lighting, motion, sound, and processing, denoising. You can choose between the easier Smart Enhancement or the Advanced one, checking the differences between the original and the rendered quality under Display Mode. Moreover, you can use the second button to change language, enable subtitles, or select chapters if available. You can also use Snapshot to export the current video frame as a picture. In addition, you can apply bookmarks on the video timeline, which are special markers that save the current frame to retrieve it any time. On the right side, you can enable Virtual Reality, or VR, or 3D mode if available. Use Settings and Preferences to set and adjust all Power DVD options. On the extreme right, use the Share button to share your video on social websites, and Play 2 to play back your media into other devices connected to Power DVD. To come back to the main interface, use the arrow button on the extreme left. PowerDVD will save the current frame in order to resume from that point when you come back to watch it. When opening a picture, the player is used to start a slideshow with all the pictures contained inside the current folder, as you can see from Instant Photo Thumbnails. You can also change the slideshow properties such as duration and transition effect. Next to the player, you can use the rotate buttons to rotate the current picture by 90 degrees, and the bin button to remove the file from both PowerDVD and your computer. Inside the music section, PowerDVD plays the sound files in order from top to bottom, unless you turn the shuffle button on. Use the repeat button to repeat the current track, and the audio equalizer to apply custom audio filters to the output sound. For additional help and information, take a look at the Learning Center. This collects several videos and tutorials on everything you need to know to start with PowerDVD. PowerDVD is also a great media player for online videos from YouTube or Vimeo. You can sign in with the key icon and start browsing content directly from PowerDVD. When opening a YouTube video, you can find the player and its buttons as seen on offline videos, but there are additional features used to enhance your entertainment. Under Stream Settings, set the video quality to use, including UHD 4K, the subtitles, or take any snapshot if you need. In case of virtual reality or 3D videos, you can enable 3D viewing mode and VR by using the 3D VR button. New in PowerDVD 18 is the ability to play back the newest 360 videos on YouTube. When you open a 360 video, the 360 view mode is enabled automatically and you can click and drag to move around and change point of view. 
You can adjust options and other points of view or enable VR by using the VR 3D button. A new amazing feature is the pin button on the right. These allow you to play back YouTube videos without any line connection. All the stored videos are listed under pinned videos on top and you can even extract their audio in AAC format by right-clicking on these and going to Extract Audio. The last section, called Devices and Home Media, collects other special extensions for PowerDVD. For example, PowerDVD Remote is an application that transforms your smartphone into a remote control, touchpad, or keyboard to browse inside PowerDVD. Whereas Power Media Player is a media player application for smart devices with the main features of Power DVD, such as audio equalizer, media entertainment, and slideshows. Thanks for watching this video. Take a look at our YouTube channel for more outstanding and free video guides.